Welcome back, it's Raktar, and I'm playing Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. As you can see, my life has taken a dire hit because I don't know how to catch bees. Presumably it's with a slingshot, but I still am at a loss for how to get a slingshot because I haven't found the shop yet because I'm a total dumb skalumski. Although while I was kind of running around town, I did notice that there is a ladder here and hopefully this will lead to something, oh, other than a rupee. Lame. Lame, lame, lack of fame. But, you know what? Maybe. Oh! It could be that maybe this falcon will... See, dude, I kept on thinking that all my problems could be solved with a slingshot. But now that I'm thinking about it, this Link in this game is really a man who is in touch with nature. He gives no fucks about slingshots and violence. He loves solving his problems by controlling animals. So, yeah, dude. This is totally what you're supposed to do. Why else would it be exactly on the height with the bird's nest? And look at that, the falcon's not afraid of bees. Bees, they sit there, they kick the shit out of Link, but... Falcon, Falcon ain't got no fear. Falcon's like, I fucking eat bees and pumpernickel bread for breakfast. I added the pumpernickel bread because he's gotta have something in there that'll give him, you know, the carbs he needs to burn throughout the day. Possibly Crispix cereal. Uh, in episode one, I talked about them possibly sponsoring me. Uh, they still haven't, still haven't called, but hopefully Crispix will... Wait, can I not pick this up? My... We just pick it up! Link, all you gotta do... Oh, whatever, let's just... Pff, fuck that. Let's see what was hidden behind the nest. If Link is too stupid to pick up that little chunk of hornet's nest, then we'll just climb up and see what secrets await me at the top of this thing. And hopefully, someday... I'll get a slingshot. I've solved, like, everybody's problems now, except for... Except for buying a slingshot. I even have some rupees now, so hopefully someday I'll be able to take the sweet, sweet... chunk of roops that I have. Oh, oh. Oh, all this hides is... Whoa! Blue rupee? That's five rupees! What kind of idiot is just leaving the rupees up here? Dude, also, what if I jumped from here and died? That would be really unfortunate! Oh, nice roll, Link. Nice death roll. Alright, let's talk to this guy now. Rektar, I saw all that. Calling down a hawk? Why didn't I think of that? I was thinking of trying to knock that down myself, but you beat me to the punch, my boy. Alright, well, can I go into your house now? No, I still can't go into your... Look, I found your wife's cat. Knocking that bee's nest down must mean you're after it too, aren't you, Rektar? You're gonna put that bee larva into... Oh, I need an empty bottle. I'll never... I'll never know... where to get an empty bottle at this rate. That's like... The thing that I'm missing right now is an empty bottle. All right, talk to you. He really is a sweet boy. He just can't be a little... All right. Go inside your house. Oh, I already went inside this house, and I already know that this house has nothing for me. There is no theft to be had here, but let us talk to all the right people. Maybe the... Maybe Leela is making a bottle for me right now, but I don't think... I think she's making me clothing, if I remember correctly. Like, she's making the, me the traditional... Legend of Zelda garb at the moment, but I feel like I've done most of what this town has to offer. Hey dude, here now, here is the door. Actually, I was trying to find this house and I was doing a really bad job because I'm stupid, trying to find which house I got the cat to go back to. I found that house. Oh, and that's the shop, of course. I knew that was the shop, I just didn't know how to do it. Hopefully she'll give me the discount on the slingshot now. Or no, she has a bottle. My kitty, today he caught a fish all by his little old self. No! I caught that fish. That cat's a lying sack of shit. If he told you he caught that fish, then I'm actually really impressed that he speaks English. So, <gasps> but it's set it to and use it with why to replenish three hearts. That's perfect. I need to replenish hearts because I was really stupid. And oh, oh, oh. there we go. I need to use. Okay, here we go. Whoa. Switching items in this game is gonna be weird to me because I'm really used to the Skyward Sword way of switching items, which is great. And if I were playing this game on the Wii, or if I were playing the Wii version, I know you, the viewer, are probably sitting there right now, you're like, Raktar, you talked mad shit about the Wii version, and now you're wishing you were playing it, but only because it would control slightly more like Skyward Sword, which is a game that I recently played. So, you know what? The only reason I kind of wish that this game... Get the... I was like saying, scoop up... The goddamn bee larva. Fish love them, and they're also edible and full of nutrients. 
I don't care about baiting. Oh, maybe if baiting my rod would have uh, made it easier to catch the thing, but instead I want to give it to this guy. No, no. No, no, don't. Oh, damn it. Uh, I should have talked to him first. I forgot that that... Oh, bee larva must be... <laughs> He's just like, thanks for fucking walking up in front of my face and eating the thing that you knew that I wanted. You're such a kind boy. Only thinking of yourself. Which is basically what that guy should have been saying to me right now, but... And I like how bee larva restores, like, no fucking health. Alright, dude, bee larva. Having bee larva... Wait, I'm trying to... I want to give it to you. But if I try and hit X... It makes me eat it. No. No. Damn it. Okay, apparently I don't understand how to give bee larva to things in this game. I thought that is something that I was supposed to be doing, but apparently it's not. In fact, what I'm gonna do is just go... Why does this guy like bee larva? Oh, cause probably because he wants to go fishing. Whatever. He doesn't even have a fishing pole, or at least, I mean, he must have a fishing pole if he wants bee larva. It's foolish of me to assume that this guy doesn't have a fishing pole, but now I am going to... Oh, don't worry, you don't have to return my empty bottle, my dear. You can use it now, put it something else. Recycling is a very important thing. You never do anything of the sort, but these kids these days toss the whole world was disposable. It's criminal. I want... Take a look. Why don't you just... I would have rather you given me the slingshot... Actually, no, I'm just kidding, because realistically, um, the slingshot is probably going to be more useful in the long run than the bee larva. Oh, and look, they sell bee larva, but check it out. I'm so awesome. I already have bee larva. So fuck you, game. I'm so cool that I already got all the bee larva because in for I want to give it to that guy so badly. I wish. But you know what? Maybe his real problem is that he doesn't have a bottle. Like, oh, can you not equip things to Z in this game? No, no, because it shows Z. What the fuck? I'm tr I'm hitting Z right now. And it's not... Okay, whatever. Okay, fuck it. I don't need bee larva. It shows Z. Is that not the Z button? No, I'm looking at my controller physically and it's showing that that's the Z button. But now that I have the slingshot, I can go and press the most important group of people of all, a group of kids that apparently think I'm cool because I'm older. Oh, hey, it's the guy with the sword. Maybe he'll give me a sword someday if I'm lucky. Ah, uh, just in time, Raktar. I just delivered something to your room. That's kind of creepy. I see you got a fishing rod, Colin. will be pleased, and it works better than you would think, right? Well, have a good one. Dude, that's kind of a mean dad. He's like, works better than you'd think. Like, he's insulting his own son's handy craftsman. <gasps> oh, and look at this. The game expected that I would have the slingshot to be able to kick the ass of this spidore. Does this drop anything? Nope. Alright, cool. Well, now that I am able to kick the ass of that bug, I can get into my own goddamn apartment where apparently all the kids like to hang out in front of the goddamn apartment all day long. They have no respect for Link. He's probably just a teenage boy wanting peace and quiet. And let's see what my gift is. If it's not a sword, I'm gonna be pissed. Whoa! A wooden sword. Huh. After honing it for you. Wooden sword! That is the lamest item in the game. Nobody ever wanted a wooden sword that wasn't a child, but I'm just gonna have to put up with a wooden sword for now, I guess. Until I leave on my great adventure. I'm sure all these kids will be impressed. I mean, it's actually, in terms of wooden, as far as wooden swords go, it's a pretty cool looking wooden sword. Like, I'll give, I'll give him that much. And look at this shit, we can kick the shit out of this dummy with it. Although, that's a pretty strong dummy. It seems to take those hits pretty well. All right. Ragtar has a slingshot. Whoa! Wow, you had enough money to buy it, Ragtar. Ooh, and that throws me, apparently, into a minigame. Kids love their goddamn slingshots. Whoa. Such targets. Many circle. Much hit. All right, well, looks like we're going to have to do some tea practice. And by tea, I don't mean drinking tea. I mean hitting some targets. Oh, targets and scarecrows. I can't believe you are so obsessed about this. It just shows that little boys you both still are. These two idiots will never shut up about it, so I guess you'll just have to show them, Raktar. Alright. Um. Mm, time to slingshot. Wait, just let me. Okay. Whoa! 
I looked at the manual in the store and it said that it's easier to hit nearby targets if you press L when you're aiming. I thought you weren't interested, Beth. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, can I not? Okay. I can get those ones. Can I walk around and- oh, nope. Ragdar, you're so close. Oh, they don't like that. Okay, I understand. They want me to do it all... They want me to do it all naturally with no walking closer. I was gonna try and L-target all these. Man, the targeting in this game... Definitely not the best targeting. But it seems to work out well enough for me. I guess I hit all the targets, so it doesn't even matter. Thanks, Rector. No, thank you for complimenting me. Obviously, as a teenage boy hanging out with children, I'm really just fishing for compliments so I can have better self-esteem, so... Whatever. You gotta teach us how to use a sword, too. Seriously, those monkeys have been coming out of the woods to play tricks on us. We want to get a good, get a good. Come on, teach us how to use a sword. I think this is the game, and it wants me to learn how to use a sword, but I'm gonna assume that I know how to use a sword. So... <laughs> I don't need to teach these children how to use a sword. Unless this is required part of the game, which could also be the case. Yeah! Alright, cool. So I just went into the settings page to see if I could uninvert the look in this game, and it appears as though I cannot uninvert the look. But I'm going to end this episode of Raktar's Adventures in the Twilight Princess universe right here in the next episode. I will be pursuing further endeavors such as probably ridding the woods of these goddamn monkeys. There's too many fucking... I don't even know that quote anymore. I'm tired of these motherfucking monkeys in my motherfucking woods. This has been Raktar. Thank you for watching.